Hello boys and girls. Let's start our lesson. The theme of our lesson is man-made masterpieces. Lesson 7, page 95. By the end of the lesson, you'll be able to improve your listening and reading skills on the cultural heritage and its importance. At first, let's check these words. Grant, locate, landscape, privacy, mausoleum, military leader, stretch, modern day, warrior, religious, construction, Dome, Tile, Pilgrim. Video на Курб, Метн де Вокндар. Булги Мараттар, Ниликтен ЮНЕСКО Нинг Бакулялим Дек Мараснар Жататнан, Айтнгар. Посмотрите видео, прочитайте текст и скажите, что делает эти объекты всемирным наследием ЮНЕСКО. Man-made masterpieces. Around the world, there are man-made architectural masterpieces that have become UNESCO World Heritage Sites. In 18th century England, Queen Anne built a palace as a gift for John Churchill, a war hero. Work began in 1705 and was completed in 1722. It was a grand project and created in the English Romantic style of architecture. Blenheim Palace is located inside an enormous park. Visitors can stroll around the grounds and see the Great Lake and the ancient oak trees, almost 1,000 years old. A lot of the palace's 187 rooms are open to the public, with a huge collection of paintings and furniture from the past. Timur was a military leader who founded the Timurid Empire, which stretched from modern-day Turkey in the west to Pakistan in the east. Timur was a fierce warrior, but he loved art and architecture and was very religious. One of his greatest projects was rebuilding the mausoleum of Koja Ahmed Yasawi, a poet and wise man who died in 1166. Construction began in 1389, but stopped when Timur died in 1405. It never finished, but it is still a beautiful example of 12th century architecture. It has 35 rooms, including the mausoleum and a mosque, and is covered by the largest dome of its kind in Central Asia. Visitors can see the original paintings and tiles on the walls inside. Do you know of any other UNESCO World Heritage Sites in your country? What makes these places so special? Now read the text again. Then read the sentences from 1 to 5 and write M for the Muslim of Koja Ahmed Yasawi and B for Blenheim Palace. The lesson is over. Good luck.